Hey Fit Fam, welcome back. We've got a 20 minute full body strength and conditioning workout. For this workout, we've got five exercises, four rounds, 45 seconds of work, and 15 seconds rest. Dumbbells are optional and there will be a no equipment modification for every move. I used two 10 pound dumbbells for this workout, but make sure to choose a weight that works best for you. Head over to Instagram and follow me to keep up with my latest workouts and challenges. First up is the deadlift to upright row. Make sure to hit that subscribe button, like this video, and let's get started. Keeping your shoulders back, engaging your core, hinge at the hips, then come up for a row, bringing your elbows to the sky. The modification is to do a good morning. Hands behind your head, then hinge forward, then come up for the row. Next up is the row to tricep kickback. Hinge at your hips around 45 degree bend forward, and if your back feels comfortable, work towards getting your torso parallel with the floor. The modification is to do half push-ups. Try to make sure you're keeping your upper body still and really working your arms as you row and kick back. Now we've got a fun one, the reverse tabletop. Put the weight between your legs. Make sure to really engage your glutes here, pausing at the top and feeling that squeeze in your glutes. Next up is the Russian twist, using one weight or no weight. Keep your back strong and rotate fully, engaging your entire core. Our next move is the curtsy lunge to press. Keeping your front shin relatively vertical and your hips square, step back just past your midline, taking a curtsy. Proper form is really important here to protect your knees and avoid injury, especially with weight. Press up with your arms as you lunge down.
I'm so glad you decided to move your body today with me. You've shown up and that's the hardest part. Let's keep working. Round two, we are one fourth of the way through the workout already. We're back to the deadlift to upright row. Using weight, these strength and conditioning workouts are all about slow and controlled movements. We aren't focused on speed, but precision. Now we are back to the row to tricep kickback. Don't forget to keep that back flat and engage your core this whole move. Next up is my favorite move, the reverse tabletop. Now we've got the Russian twist. Hold your breath and keep breathing through this move. Now we're back to the curtsy to press. Remember to keep your hips square and face forward.
It's round three and we are halfway through this workout. You are kicking butt and you've made it this far already. Don't give up. Now we've got the deadlift to upright row. Next up is the row to tricep kickback. Don't compromise your form as you get tired. Remember, the better your form, the better your results. Next up is the reverse tabletop. Next is the Russian twist. Hold that core strong as you twist. Way to go, our last move of the round is the curtsy to press. If this is hard, you are doing something right. Push yourself past the pain. Everything is temporary and we're almost finished.
round four, our last round. We've got the deadlift to upright row. Let's make everything we do here today matter. Let's leave a little stronger today, stronger than last time, better than last time. Next is the row to tricep kickback, our last time through this move. Let's make it count. Our last time through the reverse tabletop. Keep those glutes engaged and hold strong at the top. Our second to last move, Russian twist. One percent better each day is three thousand eight hundred percent better each year. We showed up today to be better versions of ourselves, and we are putting in the work to see that exponential growth. Our very last move, curtsy lunge to press. We've only got 20 more seconds of this whole workout. Let's make every rep count. Woo! I am so proud of you. You put in the work and you showed up for your mind and body. 
Thanks for working out with me today, and it would mean the world if you hit that like button and subscribe, and I'll see you at the next workout.